going to be filming my November Ipsy. Yay! I've been like just dying to film this, but I haven't had time, so finally get to open this up, and I hope you are as excited to see what's in here as I am, so let's jump right into it. If you don't know what Ipsy is, it's a monthly subscription service, and they send you f about five beauty products to your door every month. And you can either pay monthly or yearly. You get a discount if you pay yearly. I ship to Canada, so I have to pay a little bit more. I think it's around $15 a month, including the shipping. And I've tried a lot of other subscription services, and this is the only one I've stuck to. I really, really like it, and I find it's affordable and worth what you get. I usually really, really like everything they put in the bags. And it also comes in a bag, which is cool, instead of a box, because the boxes are little bit harder to reuse whereas the makeup bags they actually are useful and if not to you I'm sure someone else would love the makeup bag too. If you have any questions you can always ask me in the comments below and yeah let's get started. The first thing I see is the card that comes with it. It says girl meets glitter. Life is too short wear glitter. The secret to making the ordinary extraordinary. Add some glitter and shimmer and shine to your everyday look. Cool. Well, that makes sense with the glittery bag. This probably isn't one of my favorites compared to some of the other bags, but it's still really cute and kind of fitting for Christmas coming up, I guess. <laughs> Alright, so the first product I see is the Be A Bombshell Eye Base in Submissive. Ooh, I'm really excited about this. Let's open it up and see what it looks like. I also really like Be A Bombshell Cosmetics. Everything I've tried from them, I pretty much really enjoyed. Like their blushes, I really like their uh, blushes. So this is what the packaging looks like. Pretty similar to like the, your typical eye base packaging, I think. Yeah, this is in the color Submissive. And it's just like a deep chocolatey brown color with uh, some like gold shimmer in there. It's really pretty. Alright, the next thing I see is the CRX Micro Dermabrasion Face and Body Scrub for preventing aging. I've never tried this brand before, so I'll be interested to try it out. I have a couple scrubs that I'm using at the moment. I was kind of hoping to get the other, to get the moisturizer, or there was something else by this brand. I will be interested to try this out. Mm, it smells like oranges, and it has a really gentle exfoliant in it. Oh, it smells so good. The next thing I see is this Starlux lip gloss and it is in Guilty Pleasure. It's a really pretty neutral pink color. Isn't a full size, I don't think. I think the eye base was a full size and the CRX one definitely wasn't a full size. But yeah, the color is really pretty. It's just like a muted, dusty, rosy pink color. So I'm looking forward to trying this because I think the only thing I've tried by Starlook so far is a lip pencil. And the last thing in the bag is this Marc Anthony Oil of Morocco Argan Oil Sulfate Free Volume Shine Hairspray. It says extra hold and fast drying infused with keratin. Well, that's cool that it's sulfate free. That's awesome. The packaging is really pretty and simple. I'm interested to try this. How does it look? Oh, the smell is really good. It's very like perfumey and a little bit sweet smelling to me. I am like really bad at describing scents. So if you smelled this and were like, are you cuckoo? It doesn't smell anything like that. I don't know. But to me, it smells like fragranty and sweet and it doesn't smell like hairspray at all, which is super, super nice because who wants to smell like hairspray? Like the typical like alcohol y hairspray smell. No one. No one wants to go around smelling like that. The last thing I got for this month is the It Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye Full Coverage Waterproof Anti-Aging Concealer. It's your eight hours of sleep in a tube. Oh, is it? Because I need that in my life. I have really wanted to try this because I've heard amazing things about it. Uh, thankfully, it is a neutral medium, and I think that will suit me just fine. At least, I hope it will, because I am dying to try this. They have a freaky looking comparison on the back here. The one eye is like bruised, and the other eye is, you know, perfect magazine. But this eye, it says real results. I hope you're okay. 
Alright, that is everything I got in my November Ipsy bag. Please let me know if you got a November Ipsy bag and what you got. I love hearing what everyone else got and if you peaked or not because it is so hard not to peak. Like, I try so hard, but it's really hard not to peak. I'm really happy with everything I got this month. Um, I think they catered it to my preference really well. I always do those surveys, so hopefully that helps. But yeah, I hope you are having an awesome November and I will see you in my next video. Bye! You were waving flags that bear the colors of your love I didn't know